welcome to the GoFlow offices and here's the rest of the team. The design aspect is what I do and I just love designing stuff basically. So yeah, that's that's why I do what I do, yeah. So I do what I do because I enjoy the engineering challenge. I enjoy taking the standard GoFlow screen and adapting it according to the client's needs. I've always had an interest in how things work, and problem solving with mechanical things um, since I can remember. I've always, I've always just done sales and, and commercial development and, and uh, I enjoy it. It doesn't matter what you're, you're selling, it's always really identifying what the requirement is and, and if you can satisfy it really. In terms of projects, I mean, there's always some issue we have to overcome in the design process, but we're quite good at sort of solving problems and coming up with innovative solutions. Um, my favourite thing to do outside of work, racing cars around racetracks. <laughs> yeah, I race a Formula 4 Z-Tech, the current sort of British champion in the Monoposto Championship. It's good fun to do engineering outside of the office as well and the thrill of the competition. Um, my favourite thing to do outside of work is, um, somewhat strangely, I write and record music for TV shows. Um, and obviously you're now thinking, have I seen anything that you've done music for? And it depends. If you flick through uh, some of those obscure channels late at night, things like Wise With Knives, uh, Snapped Killer Couples, uh, Homicide Hunter with Lieutenant Joe Kendra. Yeah, so outside of work, I'm a musician and uh, yeah, write and record stuff. The Springfield project with Southern Water was quite interesting because it's on a, a very big, deep water channel on the River Medway. And because the pumping station there works 24-7, they couldn't dewater the intake. So you had to be installed in a flooded intake by divers. Certainly from an engineering challenge, it was extremely difficult. I don't think we've had a site yet that doesn't have challenges of one sort of sort or another. Um, but the war has always been solved. So it's probably seen the transition from the 3D model to actually it being fully installed and working. So it, it's the whole design process and that's what I've enjoyed throughout my engineering career. I think I um, enjoy most about my job is the, the variety. No project is the same. Uh, which can be uh, very rewarding, um, learning experiences, of course. The thing I enjoy most is probably is the design aspect, the fact that you take a customer requirement, which can be a, a sheet of paper with some sort of requirements of what they need on intake to then transfer that design, a 3D model, and then seeing that actually built and put in on site, I think is exciting to see. It's you know going from a few words on a page to a, a fully built structure doing its job. So that's, that's, what, I, that's what I enjoy about it. It's always also nice to go back after a few years and see the system still working reliably and thinking back to those engineering challenges when they first came up and then seeing the solutions we've come up with implemented when it all fits together and nice to get the feedback that it has been effective and it's clear, it's dead brief, it's quite satisfying. We offer customised bar spacing, uh, which um, stems from the requirements of the environmental agency the location where the screen will be in respect to the coastline. So we do the two mil fine screening for eel compliance sites, but customers may need 10, 15 mil on that particular site because it doesn't have eels. So we tailor each one to each site requirement, basically. And we can actually go to quite wide bar spacing, like I think you've done up to 50 millimeter bar spacing, but to be honest, we normally say six millimeters about the maximum you want to go to anyway. Because the screen's self-cleaning, you may as well just have a finer bar spacing off you know, say a maximum of six millimeter just keep the debris in the face of the screen and then the screen will automatically clean it off anyway most of the screening systems that go in are between two and six millimeter people need these screens in order to comply with regulations also not to lie with eels they're great simple to spell okay <laughs> eels are one of the great migrators of the world eels generally spawn over in the Caribbean region and then they migrate back to the European shores. Humans basically are building on their natural environment, so it's important that we do everything we can to protect them uh, and ensure that they continue as a, a species. Our job is to make sure these eels are kept where they should be in the rivers 
and not in the processing plants uh, and the hydroelectric schemes throughout the UK. Um, but the same applies to fish because they're, you know, they might not be as protected, but they're equally as important. Don't want to get ingested in the systems. Yeah, it's very effective at keeping everything out um, and keeping it in the water course where it should be and not inside the pump or turbine. The GoFlow screen comes in a variety of ranges uh, according to the client's needs. We've gone from sort of a, a very short two metre screen up to sort of eight and a quarter metres is the longest one we've done as well. So, I would say is the quality. The environments that we have to install these screens in are pretty harsh. They're obviously very wet. You never know what's going to be coming down the river and why it's going to face. But the screen has been designed to cope with all scenarios. Um, I think the top benefit of the GoFlow screen is, this, is the simplicity. Um, it's taken a while to get the design to where it is, but it is as simple as it can be, which from a maintenance point of view is ideal because the materials we've selected for the screen mean that it's very low maintenance. They're designed bespoke for those applications in water. They can go in, be installed, and then just monitored really, and then just checked over every couple of weeks. The materials used in the screen, it's all stainless steel and polymer materials, so they don't degrade over time. The fact that it's UK made um, and UK supported beams that are sort of overheads for supporting the product are less than some of our competitors, which makes us more cost effective. Everyone at GoFlow is keen to help, so please get in touch today to talk about your intake screening requirements. We're always happy to answer questions and to solve your intake screening problems.